Oh, man, that hurt. Oh, hey, what's up, everybody? It's Joel, where I do reviews, help, and gaming, and wow, ah! This is my friend Joseph, and this is my friend Deegan from school. I hope you guys enjoy. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to another Joel and Me Show video. Today, I will be opening up the, uh, what is this thing? The armor, what does that say? Corp, corpse? The armor, corpse? Um, number 26, Tiger 2. This is a Tiger 2, right? I'm trying to look for the name of the tank. I remember this thing is a Tiger. Yeah, just as Tiger. I think it's a Tiger 2. It's a, I believe, a German tank, something like that. I'm not sure. Um, but I'm not calling this a review because I'm not going to review this. I was going to. I originally got one for Christmas, and I was so hyped. Um, I opened it without reviewing it, and... Um, one of the treads was not engaging because one of the motors, um, there's individual motors operating, um, either one of the treads, and both of those motors are connected to the, uh, motherboard, well, not motherboard, the little chip or circuit board that tells it to receive and what to do when you press certain buttons on the controller. Um, but one of the motors was actually not connected to the battery. Like, I, I took it apart on Christmas Day and looked around. I unscrewed the uh, little uh, motherboard or... Uh, I'm just going to call it a motherboard, the little chip thing that controls everything. I unscrewed that, and underneath it was the battery. And the battery had a wire hanging off of it that was not connected. And that one was my one that I got on Christmas was originally this color. Like, there's four different colors. Um, but it was in a sort of brown, tan, and green camo. And this one is a light blue, dark blue, and gray and black sort of um, camo, which is the original color that I got for my grandfather on Christmas. Which um, I got one for him, and I was like, this is actually pretty cool. Why don't I? Asked my mom to get one for me because my mom had bought it off online for my grandfather and I thought it was cool so she got me one and mine ended up not working so I have the replacement right here. There is one more still um, in a box as a replacement because we ordered two replacements and this is one of them. If this one does not work, um, I'm going to test out the other one and if that one doesn't work by any chance, um, I will not be purchasing purchasing this product again so let's go ahead and okay, open it. pop the thing open with a knife and oh i just ripped the box whatever and i'm gonna go ahead and get the cardboard layer off i'll probably throw the cardboard layer away now that i've ripped it uh but if i can get this out uh like this yes okay Man, this is some tough cardboard. I'm just going to rip this up now, because it's getting annoying. There we go. Throw that stuff away, and I know how to open this thing already, because I already had it. And then there's a screw under there, which we'll go ahead and then do right now. And then we will take a close little look at our tank and see if there's any problems. So the screw is out now. I'm just gonna toss that over there. Okay. I don't see any major problems yet. Okay. There you go. So the tank works as of right now, as I can see, and then all the moat is in here. There you go. But it's in blue this time instead of green, like my last one. So I'll toss that stuff back there. I'll pop some baddies into this stuff and we will see if the Okay, tank so works. I've got baddies inside my little remote. As you can see, the lights are lighting up, although I think it's supposed to be up here, but the light is put in the wrong spot. So let's start up the engine. Uh, like that. And first try. Oh, thank God, it works.
Yay! I'm very glad. Well, you can be psycho or like that. And then there's two buttons here, which don't do anything. Or whatever. I'm just glad it works. So as you can see, both chairs are engaging. So that means I can turn my turret, fire, we'll have the recoil motion right there, as you can see. And I play a game called World of Tanks, so I know my looks of tanks and stuff, and this is a very good representation in my opinion. I'm having a bit of fun with this. And I forgot to screw in the little antenna, which increases your distance. Okay, that's if you actually screw it in. There you go, and you can spend it like that, and yay. So, thank you guys for watching the video. If you guys enjoyed, um, subscribe, like the video, and do all that. Like now, and thank you very, very much for watching.